Hello friends, welcome to our channel. So today we are going to see how in WPG you can do monthly or quarterly online payment using Stripe. All you have to do is set up a program on Stripe with your personal and publishable key. Let's just check it out. So once you log in in WPG as an admin, you will see a dashboard. All you have to do is just go to system settings, click on general settings. Now you get to the PayPal, uh, PayPal and Stripe settings. So today we are covering the Stripe the setting. So we'll click on the Stripe currency US dollar, the other number of currency we support. You need to enter the secret key and publishable key, key one by Stripe uh, in the settings area or developer area. You need to enter them here. And because we want to have the recurring payment through Stripe, we will enable it. Uh, so subscription invoices through Stripe is the option we're going to enable. And then just click on the save button. So all the options that we have entered over here in general setting for Stripe, which will be saved. And then, you know, we will go to move to the Stripe area, go to developers at the top, click on webhooks. So this is one size uh, to set up. So add endpoint. So this is the URL that will get uh, uh, the payment success or failure messages reported. All you have to do is write down your URL and then, you know, purpose slash question mark page is equal to webhook is uh, what you need to enter in as shown in the screen. Uh, the description that you can enter is that this is the endpoint for the Stripe uh, payment uh, for the gym that you own so that you know that this is the link that will be used to report the payment uh, statuses on the website or on the, in the WPG software. There are a couple of other events that you need to activate. Invoice payment succeeded. Uh, you need to you know search that event, click on it and add that as well for the endpoint. So you are all set up uh, for the you know the basic mechanism of reporting from Stripe to the WPG software. Now let's create a product. So this product, so you need to go to the menu on the lab, product catalog, add product and you know this is the name that we're gonna give uh, but ideally you want to give the Zumba uh, monthly plan uh, or Zumba gold plan or something like that add a description over here so we want to set up uh, you know one-time payment like that we have done last time so we're gonna quickly do it uh, because this series will cover everything so one of payment for whole year that will be covered using this particular product so 1000 is the uh, product price that we have set up now over here we in stripe we call it product but ideally they are the plans right so your gold membership plan or, or silver membership plan for the gym or training session is uh, like that so once the product is created now you can create uh, you know you can create different pricing options so we want to create a recurring option so click on recurring then you know price for monthly 100 usd billing period is monthly we can give the price description so for each product we can have a number of uh, different options whether it's one of payment monthly recurring option quarterly half yearly that we can create so let's just click on create a price so we have created one of price we have created a monthly price now we are going to create a quarterly price as well right so let's click on plus button uh, on the pricing and add quarterly price so it's going to be 275 instead of 300 because you know customer is paying or three months in advance so we're going to give some discount on that uh, it's a price description quarterly membership plan uh, billing period will select every three months so now we have created three different pricing uh, whole year monthly and quarterly right and now we're going to create a payment link for each of these three things right each of these three options so from the three dot menu we just created a create payment link uh, it gives you the option just click and follow the instruction on the screen and you have the payment link for the quarterly payment so copy this payment link and put it up in your uh, notepad or something that we're going to enter this in WPG setup when we create a plan right so that's how easy it is to create a plan for so now you need to do this thing for all other two uh, pricing so you need to create a payment link okay so assuming that you have created a payment link for all three pricings now let's go to membership plan and add a new membership plan so we're gonna do the Zumba monthly membership plan but it is 365 days so it's a 12 month access we're gonna add the one time amount 1000 monthly amount 100 and quarterly amount 275 USD and one by one for against each pricing we're gonna you know copy the payment link uh, and paste it so you know let's just create a payment link because last time we were so we're gonna add the quarterly payment link now over here monthly payment link 
uh, against the monthly payment uh, and one time uh, payment link which is for the whole year so we have entered all the three payment links and we just gonna add membership button click on that one so we have created this membership plan which offers three different pricing options one year quarterly and monthly so let's just see in the front end how the gym member will look uh, you know have this presented in the front end so we're going to click on a new user this is the front end for the gym member to sign up to your gym or your training session so we're going to add the first name last name uh, the gender date of birth email the mobile number the password so second section which is membership information you're going to select the zumba membership down from the down uh, and anyway, you will have the installment so monthly installment quarterly things like that so be, user will understand that they are paying monthly they will select monthly payment and it will give them the option to pay the whole uh, year pricing 1000 and monthly membership pricing is coming of $100 they need to click on the stripe icon please make sure that you enter the same email address that you have entered when you were signing up in the stripe as well so we're gonna just add a couple of details card details credit card details so that you know you can easily you know get your members to uh, get the payment done uh, so you're gonna add the card holders name and everything and once you click on subscribe button it will you know create the whole process where you know the stripe payment is collected and you know it's gonna report using that endpoint URL to WPG database that this particular customer has paid the amount successfully and their subscription is created as well in our system so let's just go in the WPG media in the back end and check it out let's search this particular user Ben DL Joseph let's see the user is already there we gonna go and you know click on the payment tab and we see the payment is collected is showing fully paid uh, under amount hundred dollar is is what is paid uh, and you know your monthly subscription history is also showing that if you click on subscription history uh, the last payment uh, and it shows the 11 out of 12 installments are remaining so this gives you clear idea that one installment has been received but you know if you want to cancel subscription you can do it from three dot menu but this is how you know you can accept the online payment on a subscription more you can always see the view invoice and you know it opens up the invoice uh, for this particular transaction this can be printed or you can also do the PDF give it to member so that this also appears in the member area by the way so this invoice is always the member themselves can download it but you can also distribute if you want for the accounting purpose so thanks for watching the video uh, we're gonna cover one more part on the same series which will be the offline so do subscribe to our channel and stay tuned to our channel watch out this particular video thank you